I've just arrived at Kung Bikan, which is the support point on day two. It's about, well, it's over halfway into day two, so it's quite a long leg to get here. Um, I've had quite a long kind of tussle with the Rinogs this, this afternoon. I've got to be honest, I've been in the Rinogs maybe four days, specifically to recce the Dragon's Back route options. And there's a whole matrix of choices. You can go kind of straight and over some really rough ground. You can wiggle and try and find paths. You can do a crazy route choice out on the road. And I've pretty much done them all. Um, and I've come to the conclusion that basically it's really tough terrain. Wherever you go, it's hard work. You rarely see anybody here. The terrain is rough. Um, you'll uh, see some of the video clips. It's uh, kind of tussocks and bits of bog and lots of rocky terrain as well. Um, occasional bilberry bushes and the light growing over the rocks, which makes it tough going. However, there are good tracks and I'm on one now. Hopefully you can see that as I spin around. And when you find the good tracks, you can make really quick progress. So I've arrived at the uh, uh, support point and found another a Dragon's Back competitor who's just come in from being wrecking the southern bit of the Rinog. So that's been, we've had a good chat and a good laugh about that. In the rough terrain of the Rinogs, there, there are actually um, sheep trods and little tracks and paths. And most of them are not marked on the map and they're tiny. They're kind of this wide, but they are there. And if you can find them, they make a huge difference to your kind of speed through the terrain. Um, I was trying to think what to say in terms of how to find these, but you, you can't. Nothing beats lots of experience and that kind of sixth sense of knowing, oh, there's likely to be a little trod here. And, you know, next walls is a good bet. Next to uh, the streams are good bets. And you, you just have to think like a sheep. <laughs> that sounds ridiculous, but that does work. And also think as a human, think, if I was walking through here, what's the easiest line? And quite often you do find a little trod, so be alert for those when you're out there. Um, but the bottom line is, it's really hard work, it's going to break a few people, you just got to suck it up and deal with the toughness of the...